What's up, dogs and doggets? Welcome back to Hearthstone. The arena runs with the Shaman. We have been destroying some people. Look at that nice little crown there. Eight wins. Only four away. Four away from the dream. So let's jump into a game. I mean, the last like three or four games have been really, really fast. We've just been owning. We've been making good decisions, and it's been paying off. So I was a little iffy when this deck was four and two, but now at eight and two, I feel confident, like I did in the beginning, that it was a good deck. Those two losses were against uh, very good decks, I want to say. Well, some of the few decks out there that were better than ours at the moment. So, all right, so we got a hunter, orange crush. Here we go in second. All right, Yeti's good. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Get a two drop. All right, we got a one. That's good enough. We can coin Panther if need be. And there's our two drop. And turn, greetings. So we got some good cards, good start cards here. Probably gonna hero power. Yep. Just like I planned. Alright, so let's throw the two out there. Hit him in the face. Since we have two two ones, we can definitely uncover our stealth. The good thing is we can keep our coin if we need be as an extra card for the giant. And he is saving up for probably an Unleash the Hounds or something. Stoneforge Axe. We'll get the axe out now. We can get the axe out next turn if need be. This guy better hope he has Unleash the Hounds. Unleash the Hounds, Wolf. I'm guaranteed what's gonna come out. Oh, I probably should have coined the Mogushin Warden. Well, we'll see what he does here. If he goes Hero Power again, we're going Mogushin Warden for sure next turn. Come on, Hero Power. Yes. Very nice. So now, this is going to be tough for him to get through. It's 1-7. It's going to take care of most of his hounds that he will put out, if any. Or he's saving up for a giant. Or Twilight Drake? I don't understand that, though. Because he is well behind already. Explosive shot. Okay. Meh. Whatever. Ooh. Should we coin giant? Oh my god. I can't pass this up. Oh, damn it. <laughs> can't coin giant. That's alright. We'll coin. We'll coin axe. Yeah, we'll hit him in the face. I'm such an idiot. God. Uh. So this is still going to be a burn to deal with. Alright, he's oozing. See what else he does, hero power. Fairy dragon. Okay, hero power. Well, that's great. Because we're going to fork lightning. Take care of business. Throw that out there. This guy might be in some trouble. He's got to start playing some cards. Next turn we put the big earth elemental out. If he even makes it the next turn. Because we got 9 damage. We got lethal on the board right now. He might be in a world of hurt. Yeah, hero power again, dude. Do it. Come on, do it. 
multi shot. Okay. Arcane shot. Okay. He survives this turn. Or does he? I don't have anything with Armani Berserk. See if you got another deadly shot in there. Kind of glad he wasted it. Alright. So we got lethal on the board again. I can't assume he has another deadly shot. He's going to need to put something out. And if you if I wait ten more turns, he's gonna wear me down with uh, his hero ability. He's highlighting it. Well played. I don't know what that guy was doing. I don't know what he was saving up for. I was waiting for the Alicia the Hounds Timberwolf combo. I mean, I have no idea. Only he knows. Whatever. Nine wins. Booyah. Let's keep this momentum going. Let's get the ten double digits DP. I know, DD. Just an old, uh, <laughs> old expression. You know, my buddy always said DP double digits when we're bass fishing. It's a big thing to hit double digits bass fishing. Um, I once caught 51 bass in one afternoon on our secret bass lake, largemouth bass. My brother, I was rowing the boat. My brother catches 54 off the front of the boat, loses 15 in a row. He could have caught like 70, 80 fish in five hours of fishing. It was ridiculous. Ah, the good old days. All right, so we got two, three. We'll drop that. Maybe get the one. Well, we got a one. That's not bad. That's not bad. I like this hand. Can't imagine he's going to do anything crazy his first turn here. If he's even here, he's not even choosing cards. Oh, there he goes. He's thinking. All right. So we're not gonna rock biter. We're gonna end the turn, and we'll greet him. All right. Let's see what he puts out. See if he coins something. Whatever he coins, we could take out with the rock biter. Huh? You don't see that too often in any in any mediums, but we'll take it out. We'll take that two damage. Right, so he's just gonna shape shift. Uh, I'll put the two three. We can go here. Let's. Uh, well, wait. Was that a two one? Um. This might not be a bad play if we put the priestess in there. I kind of don't want to do that combo because he he's just gonna hero power. Um, but if we put a four damage minion on there, you know, let's do it. I'm gonna go with this, uh, because he's gonna go up to four, and that's a little bit more difficult to deal with. It'll probably force him to go hero power into the twilight or the young priestess, not the twilight priestess. <laughs> And if he doesn't, well, hey, we'll have a 2-5 on the board. That can be enraged. Okay. So he innervated and nourished the game Mana Crystals. Interesting play. And we got ourselves a giant. Let's, uh... Let's rage with the worgen. I mean, it's actually it's not swipe bait because whichever one he doesn't swipe is going to be enraged. Yeah. 
Ooh, he's got different backs to his cards. Wow, this guy plays a lot. Swish! Swish! He's thinking. He's hovering. He's got the hover card. Boy, his, his index finger's gotta be tired from holding that button down. Holding that mouse clicker down. Alright, true to the claw. This guy has used two innervates now. <laughs> oh, jeez. I kind of don't want to attack, so let's end the turn. Then we get a fork lightning. That'd be nice. Or an axe. Alright, so it's a 6 8. What is he gonna swipe? Uh, okay. That was a good play. Good play by him. Now we're gonna come out, Frost Elemental, freeze that in place. Guy's got a lot of taunts and stuff. We need a feral spirit here. To help us out. Cult master. Well, we could draw a card. We could do this though. So put some stuff on the board. You might bypass everything and just go for my face. Okay. Miss it. Oh, what a lucky. What a lucky drop for him. And he goes right for the face. We're in a tough position here. And a murloc. And we didn't get, uh, oh, we will draw a card here. That's he's got, he's got enough damage to beat us, actually. Oh, there's the axe. Oh, we needed that before. Let's we'll see if he realizes he's got, he's got it. Shoot. That was a good run. Well play. Well play. This guy had all the right cards at the right time. His inner mates, his nourish, and taunts. That bone giant kind of hurt us. That's all right. Nine. New best. We'll take that. Let's see what we get here. Hopefully, get something good. Have we got anything good for a while? Alright, we get four. 25 dust. Ooh, gold mind control. And an arena run. Alright. Let's see if we get in the pack. Maybe we'll get something something more awesome here. Oh, this better be good. Rare. Ah, Meh. Meh. Meh, meh, indeed. Well, 9 and 3, not bad. We'll take that as a new personal best for me. Um, so leave a like, comment. Comment on how awesome the last couple uh, arena run or the last couple videos were. Coming back from 4 and 2 to a 9 and 3, we'll take that. And also subscribe for more Hearthstone with HarkDog25. We'll see you next time.